Hello children in this video we are going to discuss the difference between a general solution and the particular solutions of a differential equation let us consider first suppose this is a quadratic equation x square minus 7x plus 4 equal to 0 so by solving this quadratic equation you will get its solution x equal to 4 and 3 so these are the simply numbers similarly if we solve a trigonometrical equation you will get its solution x is equal to n pi plus minus 1 power n 7 pi by 6 where n is a integer so this is also a number However, x is angle, but angle is also a number. So, solutions of any algebraic equation or trigonometrical equations are simply numbers or angles which are also numbers. Now, let us consider a differential equation d2 y upon dx square plus y equal to 0. And uh, consider the function phi 1 x which is y equal to a cos x plus b sin x where a and b are real numbers. Now we will verify whether this function is a solution of this quadratic equation or not. For this we will find dy upon dx then d2y upon dx square substituting these values in this equation 3. In place of d2y upon dx square, we will write minus a cos x minus b sin x plus in place of y, we will write a cos x plus b sin x this is equal to 0 minus a cos x will be cancelled by plus a cos x and minus b sin x will be cancelled by plus b sin x so 0 equal to 0 or you can say left hand side is equal to a right hand side so phi 1 x that is by equal to a cos x plus b sin x where a and b are real numbers is a solution of this differential equation. This solution is called general solution because this solution contains A and B which are arbitrary constants or you can say they are parameters. Let us consider the same differential equation again that is d2y upon dx square plus y equal to 0 and the function phi 2x by equal to 3 cos x plus 5 sin x. First of all we will verify whether this function is a solution of this differential equation. Let us find dy upon dx and d2y upon dx square. Substituting the values of d2 by upon dx square and y in this equation we get minus 3 cos x minus 5 sin x that is d2 by upon dx square and uh, in place of y 3 cos x plus 5 sin x. Minus 3 cos x will be cancelled by plus 3 cos x minus 5 sin x will be cancelled by plus 5 sin x. So 0 equal to 0 or left hand side is equal to a right hand side. So we can say y equal to 3 cos x plus 5 sin x is a particular solution of this given differential equation. Why particular? Because it contains no arbitrary constants. What particular values in place of arbitrary constants? This is the basic difference 
between a general solution and particular solution. If solution contains arbitrary constants, it is called a general solution. And if a solution contains particular values in place of arbitrary constants or parameters, then the solution is called a particular solution.